the 14 inch macbook pro or the 16 inch which one should you get i've had the 14 inch macbook pro since launch but i recently got the 16 inch for work and i would like to share my thoughts as both of the sizes have their pros and cons i really enjoyed using the 14 inch for my day-to-day -day work i did a lot of scripting coding and video editing on the machine it was great to take with you on the go and work on the plane train or in an uber it was also great to just chill with on the sofa or your bed and watch a movie, show, or YouTube video. When I was deciding on which size to purchase originally, I was considering the 16 inch, but I thought that would be too big to carry around and keep in my backpack. It also would be a hassle to use when around other people like on a smaller coffee shop table or in an airplane. The size was the main issue as to why I got the 14 inch, but I should have considered some of the benefits of the larger display instead of just focusing on one downside. With my new job, they gave me the 16 inch MacBook Pro and I've been using it for a few weeks now. Although the large size does have its issues, it also has many benefits. The main benefit is the screen real estate. I use a laptop for programming, emails, teams meetings, and going through documentation. It's so nice to split the screen into two windows and have multiple things open at once. It's definitely no ultra wide, but much better when comparing to a 14 inch screen. Also, the speakers are really great if you aren't a headphone user. If you're listening to music in the background or watching a TV show or movie, the sound will be very nice. So if you have a laptop only desk setup, this will be a great upgrade to have propped up on a nice laptop stand on your desk. The 14 inch has been my main laptop for the last nine to 10 months and I absolutely love it. My laptop before this one was a 15 inch Intel model from 2018 and I did think it was a bit too large for me. The 14 inch is a perfect size and easy for you to carry around and use on the go. You also will not have to worry about it not fitting inside your backpack which is an issue with the 16 inch the only downside for me with this size is the lack of screen real estate which after a while you do get used to and it doesn't bother you as much if you plan to dock it to a monitor and use it like that most of the time then the size shouldn't even be an issue at all the speakers aren't as good as a larger one but they are still solid if you aren't a headphone user i use them quite often and think they're just fine so which one should you get my recommendation would be based on how much moving around you do if you're mainly at home and have a laptop only set up or dock your laptop into a monitor then i'd say go with the 16 inch to get some more screen real estate if you're on the go a lot and have to work around people especially on public transportation get the 14 inch it's a perfect size to use on the go and if you want to dock it and use it as a desktop you can do that too while taking up less space on your desk i didn't really go over the specs in this video as both computers are the same when it comes to that obviously the larger one has a larger battery but that's about it so when purchasing you can pick whatever specs you'd like i personally have the 14 inch in space gray with 32 gigs of ram and 512 gigs of storage i hope this video helps you decide on which one to get i think the new m2 macbooks will be releasing soon as well so that's something to look forward to thanks for watching please like and subscribe if you found the video interesting and follow my socials for more tech and coding content. That's it for me today. Have a great day.